Can autonomous driving be dangerous for the future? Engineers at the world's leading tech and automotive businesses are competing to develop an autonomous vehicle that is both reliable and economical. Driverless cars are getting closer to being a reality. It is not an issue of if self-driving cars will become popular in the mainstream market, but rather when they will do so. What kind of an effect does autonomy have on the level of safety? Is it possible that GPS tracking could improve the overall safety of vehicles? Relax, TechZen is here to answer all of it. Google, the Defense Advanced Research Projects Agency, DARPA, automobile manufacturers and academic institutions from around the world are all working diligently to make this a reality. The potential for widespread usage of driverless automobiles brings with it a number of benefits including a reduction in the number of automobile collisions as well as the economic toll inflicted by the resulting loss of life, injuries, or damaged property. These autonomous vehicles maximize driving efficiency and reduce traffic congestion and financial savings and energy expenses will also be realized. The potential positive impact on the economy as a whole might be substantial. However, this does not mean that there won't be any unexpected effects that come up as a result of the revolution toward driverless cars. What are the risks associated with self-driving and autonomous cars? There are no completely autonomous vehicles currently available for use on public roads in the United States for purposes other than testing. Driverless cars or automobiles that are equipped with a variety of automatic capabilities are already being driven on public roads. With the rate at which technological advancement is occurring, it is almost probable that we will see autonomous vehicles operating on public roads at some point in the not-too-distant future. Automobile collisions are consistently one of the major causes of fatalities and serious injuries sustained all around this nation each year. However, the concept of self-driving cars is certainly intriguing, particularly when it comes to reducing the number of accidents that are caused by drivers who are under the influence of alcohol or drugs. Drivers who are weary from driving or drivers who are traveling at an excessive pace there have been several difficulties in 2018 testing of autonomous vehicles by Uber and other companies got underway in the state of Arizona. In a tragic turn of events, one of those automobiles was responsible for the death of a woman who was crossing the street in Tempe, Arizona. When the accident took place, there was a person sitting in the driver's seat of the vehicle. This driver was expected to take over control of the car if there was any chance of an accident, but the driver failed to do so. This was not a problem with a self-driving vehicle, but rather with the driver of the vehicle. There have been a number of incidents in which autonomous driving features have been the source of problems on the roads. At the beginning of 2021, for instance, a Tesla Model 3 electric automobile was involved in a collision that resulted in a fatality in the state of Southern California. When the vehicle crashed into an overturned truck in the middle of the night, the autopilot system had been enabled before the collision. This is only one instance out of many more in which autonomous vehicles have been involved in collisions while their autopilots or other capabilities were activated. There are a number of potential dangers you need to be aware of as we move forward with the development of self-driving automobiles. You may rest assured that automobile manufacturers are aware of these dangers and are working to reduce the likelihood of accidents involving their products even before they hit the market. 1. Unemployment People whose livelihoods depend on operating motor vehicles such as cars, trucks, and buses will unexpectedly find themselves without paid employment if self-driving technology becomes widespread. In 2019, the Bureau of Labor Statistics of the United States of America estimated that there were more than 2 million people working as tractor-trailer truck drivers. There are 370,400 people working as drivers for taxis and delivery services, and there are more than 680,000 people working as bus drivers in the United States. When taken as a whole, this indicates the possibility of the loss of more than 2.9 million employment, which is higher than the number of jobs that were lost in 2008 as a direct result of the Great Recession. When you add in drivers of delivery and light trucks, which count for 1.5 million employees, the total number of potential jobs lost rises to an astounding 4.5 million. After taking into consideration all the managerial, administrative, and support personnel for these driving roles, the total number may potentially treble. It will be challenging for these unemployed employees to rapidly find new employment and the expense of retraining them could end up being rather costly. 
it's feasible that in a few generations' time, very few people will even know how to drive a car, which would be an interesting and perhaps disastrous outcome. 2. Hackers taking over vehicles In the past, security experts who were attempting to attack vulnerabilities in current automobiles have successfully hacked and been able to take control of a Tesla Model S and a Jeep Cherokee. Their goal was to find vulnerabilities in modern automobiles and exploit those vulnerabilities. The technology and software of a computer would handle all of the driving duties in an autonomous vehicle. A hostile attacker may locate and exploit security weaknesses in any one of a number of complicated systems in order to seize control of a vehicle or even intentionally cause it to crash. It is anticipated that autonomous automobiles of the future will be networked so that they may speak with one another and send and receive data about other vehicles on the road. Attacks on a network of this kind may bring to a grinding halt all of these robotic cars that are currently driving around. The manufacturers of autonomous cars are hiring personnel to try to uncover and patch any security flaws that they can find today, but creative hackers will definitely find new and novel ways to get around the security protections that are already in place. 3. The Auto Industry People will rely more and more on calling a driverless car from a shared fleet akin to calling an Uber, which would cause a fall into private ownership of cars. This is one of the potential consequences of a world with autonomous cars. Why buy an expensive piece of machinery that's prone to breaking down when you can just make a phone call and have a self-driving car come pick you up and take you wherever you want to go? If people stopped owning their own cars, it would be catastrophic for the automotive industry. This would result in the loss of employment, both directly and indirectly, as well as billions of dollars worth of economic production. Traditional manufacturers like General Motors, GM, and Ford, F, had been slow to adapt to change. If this scenario plays out the same way some analysts anticipate, these companies could once again find themselves in a precarious financial position. 4. The Auto Insurance Industry there are currently auto insurers operating in a market that is quite competitive and has margins that are extremely tight. The cost of insurance is determined by the likelihood that a risk will materialize, such as an occurrence involving drunk driving or an accident. The introduction of driverless cars is expected to significantly cut down on the occurrence of both risks and accidents that include pedestrians. The cost of insurance will plummet as a direct result of the elimination of hazards associated with human driving by technology the existing business model for vehicle insurers becoming increasingly irrelevant, there is a possibility that some of them could go bankrupt.